Elenium is a four-year-old uh, company out of Melbourne, Australia. Our primary focus, as Shashank has mentioned, is improving passenger self-service using innovation, using the latest technology. We've got a full set of end-to-end -end tools, uh, including kiosks, bag drops, gates on the hardware side, and um, a CUS platform with 45 airlines on it, plus our own white label applications on the, um, on the software side. Our tools are all modular and they work just as well together as well as working on some of our competitors' um, equipment and platforms as well. Now, studies have shown that if you check three vital signs, temperature, respiratory rate, and heart rate, instead of just one being temperature, the accuracy of actually predicting uh, an individual that's not well goes up to 93% from 65, which is basically a 50% increase. So restoring trust in travel is absolutely essential for the full capacity to be brought back to pre-COVID numbers. We believe API is absolutely placed to help with this. So what API has done, we've built a digital health passport. People self-declare, then they seek verification of that credential. They then carry that on their mobile app, whether it's through uh, a device, a smartphone, or on an iWatch or a smart, a wearable app. You check in at home using an airline app, which will ask you if you have an e-tag. You then switch the tag on, and the app will go out via our back office TagX to the departure control system, pull the relevant flight information, and then using low energy Bluetooth, will write to the two e-ink screens which will automatically turn off. You can then go to the airport, simply drop your bag and fly. And on arrival, you'll be able to get an alert that your bag is on the belt waiting for you. And there's no need to join a throng of people. In this COVID era, there are significant benefits to using electronic bag tags. There's no need to queue to check in, no need for human assistance, no need to print bag tags, and no need to wait at baggage claim. And this helps, of course, in limiting human contact. It frees up valuable space at the front of the airport for social distancing. It increases the throughput of people. And importantly, it makes both passengers and staff feel safe. Max is basically a B2B application that really does make the whole journey for your passenger, for your staff and passengers significantly better. How do we connect every touch point? How do we eliminate every piece of paper? And how do we promote a really contactless journey? So from that, six years ago, we started Max, or we started Lavati and Max. Um, Max uh, is a family of applications. There are four core applications in our suite at Max Airport, Max Ramp, Max Crew, and the Recovery Suite. Today, we're gonna to focus on Max Airport and Max Crew, which is really a full extension of your, of your DCS, so a mobile DCS, and Max Crew really does create a true paperless cabin. So we are a B2B application. Our applications today are designed for iOS. We really do create a fully digital mobile contactless operation. So that means your workforce can be completely um, uh, unrestrained from any of your check-in desks or ticket counters or boarding gates. So a fully mobile workforce. Um, in the current world of COVID, uh, it also means the flexibility of a mobile solution means I can improve passenger and staff safety and, make, and support social distancing. The social distancing mon monitoring module, uh, what it is, is uh, it it's, it's actually gives uh, the airports, uh, you know, a way of digitally monitoring uh, that passengers are actually, uh, you know, at a safe distance. Now, if you look at this, uh, I have a small GIF which is being played here. Uh, we, this was implemented at one of our airports in India. Uh, so what happens is essentially if two people come in close contact, uh, you know, and, and are, in, are in close contact for about 15 seconds, then we trigger an alert uh, to the people, uh, to, you know, on their mobile apps and uh, in the back end, the airport also has a dashboard where they are monitoring the, uh, you know, the alerts which get triggered. 
we also have an interesting feature where we actually geofence uh, dense zones. So if a person is actually getting into a zone which is quite crowded, we actually warn them beforehand. Uh, we tell them this is a crowded zone, so uh, be careful. This is the 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 dashboard which the airport gets, where uh, you know uh, they're actually monitoring the movement of passengers in real time. And uh, you know, in case there is there is a social distance breach, then immediately there is an alert which which is which pops up on the dashboard, and the airport can take necessary actions.